Hello and welcome to this new video in which I'm going to show you how to run the auto correlation test by the bridge Godfrey. So, auto correlation is a very important the hypothesis that you need to, to check before interpreting your regression result by ordinary means. So in this case, in which we have uh, error terms that are auto correlated, you need to correct that using. Generalize this way that we can discover uh, in this uh, and by clicking just on top of this video at the right. So, uh, autocorrelation is uh, one of the hypotheses that are hidden behind the, the linear regression alongside of uh, normality and most elasticity. So, what to test the uh, autocorrelation using the uh, Bridge got free LM test. So, the first step is to estimate uh, our linear regression. And by the way, we have the data set containing information like uh, macroeconomic information, like GDP, logistics like capital formation, additional government finance consumption expenditure, in percentage of GDP. We have uh, variable like uh, general government investment, and we use the, those variables in the equation in order to test for automation by the correct but free test. So the first step is to estimate our equation using the command press press and by our dependent variable which is TGP, our independent variable are gross fixed capital formation, percentage of TGP, uh, investment and finally uh, general gross capital formation and general government investment. You click on OK and you can see the result of our result. And the final step is to uh, just do the command P, cut free, or bread cut free. In the end, uh, just click on OK. And you can see that the bread cut free LM test for the correlation table has been generated, and the normal hypothesis is a new serial correlation. As far as p value is uh, 0.000, that are less than 5%, uh, which is the threshold used in statistical uh, social sciences. So we reject the null hypothesis, meaning uh, that our error terms are auto correlated, meaning that uh, the ordinary least score estimation and it's not appropriate. So we use generalized least score method in order to estimate our model that you can discover just right on the top of this video at the right. So uh, let us uh, say uh, if you have not done so, do subscribe and activate the notification bell in order to watch the next video. So anytime soon.